know what I mean? The first thing is, oh yeah, we say, it doesn't fall up, it only falls down. But when we went out in the crane, I suppose, you know what I mean, it was all different cranes then. Yeah. There was 13 different type of cranes, and you had to be 100% as fast as the other person falling down in the cargo. My first day up in the crane was on a timber boat up at number six shed. And there was a, this big docker foreman called Rollo Fulham. And by Jesus Christ, could he rock. So you'd be going in, you'd grab the timber, and you'd be holding it, and your hand would be white. You'd be real tense and all that, and you'd be going. And next minute, you have this big docker underneath your foreman, and he'd be screaming, I want to get out of here. Will you hurry up? It wouldn't suit everybody no. crying to because you're on your own and also you couldn't be afraid of weights or anything no, like that. that's it. It wasn't physically turning, it was mentally turning because you had to concentrate. No matter what you did, you had to concentrate. It was a dirty job now, you know, it was very dirty, you know. Especially when you were only starting and young, you were taken up and you used to have to climb up onto the jib. The jib you, yeah. There was a ladder up all the way up the jib and when you went up onto the top of the jib, you yeah, used to have either a grease gun with you or a syringe, a syringe yeah. with oil. And you used to have to get the, to get the, the oil shaves. and put it into the shaves. Normally they put them, they put them out over the river. Over the river. Yeah, oh yeah, that if you fell off, you go into the river. <laughs> yeah. John no, Coffey used to put it over the shed. Yeah, in case he... Yeah. So you go yeah. through the roof of the shed. Yeah, yeah. He, he said he couldn't swim. <laughs> he said he couldn't swim. <laughs> he couldn't yeah, yeah, swim. Yeah. It was great friendship made on the cranes and, and the same made with the doctors. You, yeah. you got to know the doctors real well because you worked with them. The years that you spent on the cranes flew in, didn't they? Yeah, yeah. Like they, they really just flew in. You didn't realise they were going in so quick. Because every day was something totally different. You knew it. Very that's proud. I mean, we were their families. And that's it. Bought our houses, we had holidays. That's it. Are we doing well over now, you know? We've, they done well. Uh, you wouldn't be. You wouldn't have to. What you have today, you know, only for the crimes. You know, you wouldn't. Have, you wouldn't have it. If you're coming down, say you're going to the point, or bring your family to the point, you, you sort of say, "Yeah, look at that. That was my bread and butter." You know. That, that, that.